Have you ever laid on a bed of warm grass, stared into the sky and studied the changing anatomy of a big, fluffy, white cloud as it floated gently overhead? It's a transformation so magnificent, so gradual, yet so complete that you hardly even notice it. Here you go, Melvin. Thank you. I'm more of a blogger myself. Blogger, huh? Yep. Nail art. Do, do you have any followers or anything? Followers? Uh, let me think. Last month I had about 86. 86, that's great. And then I jumped to 91, mm -hmm. and then this morning I had 94, so... Yeah, about 94,000. <coughs> oh. Are you okay, Melvin? <clears throat> um, did you say 94,000? Yeah, but that was 10 long months of hard graft. Okay, uh, can I see those nails again? Mm -hmm. Okay. That'll be $11.20. Yeah, can, can you just put it on the, uh... Hey, hey, no. No more tabs, Melvin. You owe me 275 already. I'll settle up next week, because th this is the one. That's what you said for the last 14! Yeah, I got a meeting, I got a... being short. I'm just not sleeping. I haven't had a decent night's sleep in months. I've tried medication. I've tried yoga. I've tried not chatting with you. Nothing works. Electricity, phones, rent. At this rate, we'll be lucky to make it to the end of the month. Oh, and Melvin's still here. Got off a call, one of our new writers just penned a million dollar deal with a major studio. Zombie superheroes. Fresh. You've got to be these days, Melvin. It's not enough to find a gap in the market. You have to find a market in the gap. Market in the gap. So, the anatomy of clouds. Volume three. Oh, okay. I'm very excited about this one. Okay. Have you ever laid on a bed of warm grass and stared up into Melvin. a sky filled Melvin. with cloud that... I'm, Hold on one second. No, Melvin. I waited an hour and a half. Melvin, filled with I'm, clouds and I'm dropping you as a client. I've tried everything. I've shopped your work to publishers. I've pitched it at TIFF, MIFF, BIFF, VIFF, KIFF, YIFF, Sundance, CAN. I mean, I'm sorry, but... If it hasn't happened already. Melvin, your script. Well, I'm gonna go home. Might as well dust off the old resume. Zoe, would you do me a favor? Take this home and give it a quick read through. Make me feel better. Are you kidding me? You want to be an agent, you have to learn to read material. The Anatomy of Clouds?
What's with you? I slept. Like never before. Sir, do you need help finding something, sir? Um, I, I'm, I'm not exactly sure what I'm looking for. Hello, hello? Wait, right, right now? I, hello? Elizabeth, hello? So, doctor, you've had Melvin's manuscript for a week. I've been a practicing sleep therapist for nearly two decades. We've had patients suffering chronic insomnia for years. Most end up on medication and some end up suicidal. Oh, awful. So I sent copies of Melvin's manuscript to some of those patients as he requested. And? The results were uh, nothing short of astounding. I'm sorry, I, I don't understand. Two patients reported falling asleep while reading the contents. I knew it. Based on our initial research, it's clear that your writing has a very powerful effect on people. Son, it puts people to sleep. What the? Wait, wait, wait. No, did, you hear, wait. I, did you hear what he just said? Melvin, calm down. Well, no, I must confess. I read the manuscript myself, and I've never read such. Uh, mind-numbing tedium in all my life. Do you have any more material? Okay, that's it. I don't have to put up with this. I don't even know you. And what the hell does he know about the pain, hard work, and dedication it takes to write a novel? He is tedium by the bucket load. Oh, God, that's it. All right, I'm out of here. Forget it. We'll talk soon. I probably wouldn't be in this mess if it weren't for you. I mean, what kind of agent are you anyway? I'm an agent for truth, Melvin. And truth be told, you have underperformed both commercially and creatively for the best part of 25 years. So I'm sorry, what do you expect me to cave in? Just, just give up at this point in my career? What career? Elizabeth, what are you up to? Here's the deal, we do it my way. Well? What's the deal? I want you to send me everything you've got. We're looking for uneventful, mundane, slow-moving stuff, basically everything you've ever written. When are you going to stop with the humiliation? You've got The Anatomy of Clouds, volume one, two, three. What else have you got? The one with the cow. Wait, this all makes me uncomfortable as an artist. D-Day for Daisy. Remind me of the premise. Winter 
as seen through the eyes of an Oregon dairy cow. Of course. How could I forget the 1,200 page D-Day for Daisy, that epic piece of... It's perfect. Wait, where are you going? We've got work to do. I did this to myself.